Hi, my name is Ellie and today I'm cooking in the Unicrew 12 with the Unicrew gas burner, the new one. So here are all my ingredients. I've been making a barbecue steak pizza. Let's do it. I don't know if you can see my my hole. I just I just repair it by prodding it. it. Normally works. It's normally okay. You just don't want your tomato sauce to seep in there. Otherwise, it will get stuck in your pizza oven, and that's a bit of a nightmare. you are ready for the cook okay so here we are I've just turned it down a second because it was hot too hot this is how fast it cools down I wonder if it's cooling down too much I actually put it on low and it went off yeah okay so that's probably why it cooled down in like a minute Okay, it's going back up again now. Yeah, pretty fast. Okay, I'm just gonna leave that for a few seconds to warm up and we'll be ready to cook it. I'll just give it a little wiggle. Am I on full flame on the dial right now? Yes, I am for warming it up, but I have cooked a pizza before, so it's not completely cooled down. That's why I'm not too concerned about whether it's dead on 430 because I know the back of the stone is going to be hot but I'm going to turn it down a little bit I'm going to turn it down to three quarters flame it's quite big it's nearly full to be honest but it's not full flame give it a wiggle make sure I've got my peel ready Hey, let's put this in. So this is another test I'm doing with the Uni Crew 12 gas burner, the new one. I've cooked this exact same pizza with the same dough, same toppings, in the wood burner, with the wood burner. And I want to see how it cooks with the gas burner. Because I'm doing a number of tests with it at the moment. So, gosh, I thought I'd gone out then. I think the flame goes quite high. I've said this before. I think the flame goes is being pulled up by the chimney there, if you can see. And so it's hitting the toppings and then the crust, the base of the crust is not so much getting touched, but the top of the crust is. So I just want to check if that's happening again. I'm just yeah, can you see there? Like the it's not touching that bit, it's, it's on the top. And I keep thinking to myself, if I leave it in there long enough, it'll start to cook the, the bottom of the base of the crust, but it doesn't. It just cooks the top more. And uh, so I have to accept that's where it cooks, because you see that it's 
cooking right at the top. So, uh, yeah. I'm gonna give it a bit more, but I think the crusts are done. It's just uh, maybe a bit more on that side. And a bit more on that side. Done. What you doing? This ball keeps going under the table. Oh, I'll go and get it for you now. I'll go and get it for you now. Just want to show nice and crunchy. It's like no matter what I do, the crust always cooks in the same place. There's the base, it's got a nice Nice base cook. And the crust, it's got that high cook again. So if you see the wood crust, They are, and then that's where it's cooked there. So it looks as if I haven't cooked it there. Well, then when I turn it there, it looks it's cooked. Let me give that piece a try. Mmm. Oh my God, I love barbecue steak pizza, and this crust has gone a bit better there because it was thinner. So it's covered more of the crust. Looks good. Nice. It's got a good base cook. And there. And the toppings are cooked really well. Pizza's cooked lovely. Mm, I love barbecue beef on pizza. Yum. I hope you found this video useful. Hit the like button if you did. Subscribe for more videos and to support the channel. Take care and I'll see you soon.